normal weekend shenanigans type of week. Like, I had an okay week at work. Not really doing nothing this weekend. I got home yesterday evening. And I literally ate, took a bath, and laid down the rest of the night. Like, I didn't do shit else yesterday but relax. And this morning, I got up. I took a wash up. Cleaned up my apartment, you know, took out the trash, cleaned up my dishes. I had already vacuumed or whatever. Made up my bed, tried to put some clothes away. And then I went to the store. And now I'm home. I'm about to go back out um, when Gina gets here. Because I needed something to eat. I have not ate. I ate like a muffin and some in, and drunk some Ensure. Because my energy level has just been really, really bad. And surprisingly, it's easier for me to get my vitamins and minerals if I drink it versus me taking a pill. So when she get here, I'm going to go give me something to eat and we're going to make another home decor run real quick. But I'm waiting on Gina. She should be here. She says she's going to leave out at like 3 o'clock. It only takes her like 20 minutes to get here. But I went to Target and I'll show you what I got, y'all. So I got this wine. California roots and I hope it's good because a bitch got three bottles but they were five dollars a piece so this one is just the plain Moscato let me know if y'all tried this I feel like I've had this one before and I liked it I mean how you fuck up Moscato but um yeah I don't know. I got this one, which is just a plain Moscato. And then this lady in Target was all up in my business. She was like, okay. Like, bitch, I like wine. No, I'm not going to drink them all at the same time. But damn, you are nosy. Anyways, I was nice about it. I got this one, which is the Sangria flavor. I feel like this one's going to be the best one out of all three. And then the last one that I got, the pink Moscato. You can't get the regular Moscato without getting the pink. So I will give y'all a review on those later. Keep our Target bags. We may need them in the future. So we can throw the rest of them away. And then I also got these shorts, just lounge around shorts. They were only $7.50. So I got a pair to wear around the house or whatever. Throw them over. Then, y'all, durable plastic Tupperware. Well, not Tupperware, dishes. 75 50 cent. 75 50 cent. So I got me gray dishes. It was either gray or black. Since I already have like glass black dishware, I decided to get just um, gray plastic ware. So I got four bowls. So a bitch can finally like eat her oatmeal in a bowl. Because. Yeah, I ran out of my, um, what did I run out of? I ran out of my, um, pla my, like, plastic bowls, throwaway bowls. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. So I'm put my bowls in here. Should I wash them? Maybe I should wash them. Hold on. I'm gonna, like, run some water and then put some baking soda in there just to wash them off. Cause I don't know who's been touching them. You know, you can't be so sure these days. Okay. I'm gonna just like rinse them off a little bit. Anyway, I can wash them real quick. So I'm so happy to finally have some dishes. I need to get some knives. I think I'm going to look for a knife set uh, next time I go out if I don't find one today because I don't have no knives. I got these. I need to get. I didn't get that either. I didn't get a silverware tray. Like, my silverware just stays in the dish thing because, yeah. 
I didn't get no ice trays. So I'm gonna look for that. Like, I may actually go to the Target across the river because that's where we're going and see if they got one. But I really think they might have one cheaper at like Ross or Gabe's. So we're gonna try those two places real quick since the sun has decided to come back out and it's not raining right now because I think it might rain again later. So yeah, I got me some plates. And I got me some Paul cups. Which I use paper cups on a regular, but just in case I'm out of those, I want people to be able to have cups. So yeah, I need an ice tray. Ice tray, uh, ice tray, silverware tray, and um, some knives. And then I'll be done as far as dishes are concerned. I got plenty of Tupperware and all of that. Um, so yeah. I'll be done with that stuff. I got plenty of pots and pans and stuff like that. Um, my mom had got me a set from pennies they're already put up in the cabinet or whatever so i'm good there i really just need some last minute touches like some wall art um in my mirror i want a floor mirror and a wall mirror i just haven't really had the time to look and to be honest i really haven't had the fun but We'll see what happens after rent. <laughs> we really will see after rent. And I don't want to ask my parents because they've already been such a blessing. And I just I want to be able to get it on my own, you know. But whatever I don't get, like, I'll get it later. The fuck? I'll get it later. Like, for the most part, I got the big furniture. And I'm happy. So, yeah. I might just have like a little, honestly, a little daytime kickback. Not necessarily a housewarming. As much as I would want to. You know? Yeah, the sticker is, is coming off of the dishes. So I'm trying to like get them off. It's just, you know, they're coming off. <laughs> but I just wanted to check in with y'all. I really didn't have nothing going on. Here, I'm gonna let that soak real quick. Let me finish showing y'all what else I got. And then I'm gonna finish these dishes before I go back out. And then I'll just come back on then. Let's just do that. So I went to Walmart because I was going to get me like something from Subway, but I was like, eh, I don't want to. So I got this little dress, which I thought was super cute. It's cute, right? For the summer, you know, maxi dress, sundress season is in full fucking effect. I got me another pajama set, which is super cute and lightweight. It's just a little pair of like leopard print multicolored shorts and then i got the matching tank top so yeah y'all know me i'll make it loungewear real quick and then i just really like this top y'all know i love me a crop top tank top and it was super cute because i like the buttons and i don't have one like this so I got it to go with like other shorts, jeans, leggings, when I'm actually clear to wear those things again. I did put on like my normal underwear for the first time. They're not like not all the way up or whatever because I still have that um, little word catheter still hanging out. So I have to make sure that I have on loose fitting bottoms because it can cause irritation but for the most part it's healed i just i was like you know what i'm not wearing depends no more <laughs> if i'm wearing underwear if i'm not wearing underwear i'm wearing some form of like breathable shorts i completely understand why niggas why men sorry wear boxers 
or they just wear basketball shorts because it's so much com so much more comfortable. I don't know who said that women had to wear underwear. Like, I think that's why we be having so many problems because we be conforming to westernized thinking that we have to wear drawers. Like, I feel so much free, freer. She feels so much happier, you know? Granted, it's definitely important if you are not wearing drawers, you might want to make sure she's clean. Because we definitely can't have you walking around here funky. But as long as you're doing that, I see no problem not wearing drawers. All right, y'all. I'll see y'all later. <laughs>
but I'm watching YouTube right now. But I just wanted to come back and end this quick ass vlog. I'm sorry, the vlogs have not been as entertaining, but y'all know, besides going to work, I've just been getting moved in and chilling. Like, ain't really too much going on in the city but craziness. And your girl's on a budget, so. But I'll probably end this vlog once I get my package from Poshmark. So y'all may not get this vlog until like damn near Tuesday night. Not gonna lie to you. Cause I wanna go ahead and get that up and out of the way. Cause I may not upload next weekend. Just FYI. Um, just because I don't have nothing to do. I'm trying to get this apartment in some type of order. Cause I wanted to have a little kickback, housewarming kickback the weekend of the 27th. So, I need to get these clothes up out of the way. Granted, ain't nobody gonna be in my room, but it bothers me. And I still need to get my floor mirror, my wall mirror, and some wall art up. Cause look at this, look at this. No, but we're almost there. I had a chill, nice relaxing weekend. But I'm about to just, I'm about to just watch YouTube and relax to be honest watching Peyton right now. Love me some Peyton Charles. I won't be on her level one day. <laughs> but I hope y'all had a good weekend and I hope y'all have a great week and I'll see y'all in the next one. <laughs>